you to get Internet Sensation Jelly Donut through here. I'm going to show you my awesome new Loot Crate stuff. This is my lovely assistant. Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing. I believe this is for the month of April. April. Of April. April 2015 this is here. That is the current year also. We're not opening vintage Loot Crates. <laughs> we could, in theory. Wait, I need to get back there. I just didn't open it now. So it's ruined. What? Okay, first off, there's a treasure map, so that's... This has come a long way Wait, I should from when I used to... Conceal this, because now you know where my treasure is. It's an empty planet bar. It's gone. <sighs> I didn't even have a chance. It's or been we... gone since the second you opened that box. We've got some sort of symbol on this shirt. I can't see it because my face is blocked. <laughs> Can you identify that? It's a dragon. It is a dragon. Is it a specific it's an dragon? ampersand dragon. It's an ampersand dragon. I assume it's from Karate Kid 2. I believe, yeah. Um, so I can strikes back. Oh, back. Oh, print of Karate playing cards. Oh, in the back. It's got, it's got his mask. Oh, man, black. It doesn't really look like Harry Holders, though. They couldn't secure the rights. Just, they've got the movie and the film rights, so like, like this? No. Mm -hmm. No. The estate wasn't into it. This is apparently my albino dragon. That's the Do you think that's what the ampersand dragon stands for? Maybe he does. But he's not albino. He's very... Well, he's, the ampersand, it could be read as an A. Yeah, but he's got a lot of melanin. Like, he's in no way albino. Well, I mean, that's just racist. I want to see who the face cards are. It's just every card is just Andre the Giant. <laughs> it's non stop Buzzick. Mm -hmm. See, I don't know characters' names. I don't I could recite, but it took you the rest of this entire film of me reciting the Prince of Bright. The, I can give you like the main quotes, and then anybody wants to see. I'm running now, I mean. Yeah. That's about <laughs> the extent of my that's knowledge. The, that's the albino. Uh, speaking of albinos. <laughs> I don't know what it is, an unusual size of the other Joker. You know, uh, no, you can't see that's fine. Joker Prince always the best. Aces. Who we got? Small oh, animal quotes. They got animal quotes. See, now you're, figure it now you're cheating. You can't repent the movie, you're just reading quotes off the card. Well, it's not Is every card a different person, or is it just face cards? Just a face card. Prince Humper Day? Huh? Surrender. Oh, he's gone forever. Well, now we can't even play solitaire. What else do we got? Lots of cameras. Uh, anybody want a peanut? Is that, is that literally the same? That's literally. Oh, man. Alright, let's get these. Let's get these cards going. Let's just play a game. If you want, I can fly. Oh, that's because my true love lives if you want, I can fly. Alright. In time, As well as Sean or Sean Wallace. Interchangeable. 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 Legally speaking. Uh, this guy's name is Nico Montoya, and you killed his father. Prepare to die. I don't know, I don't like Shining or White. It's Carol Kane. Classic. Um, Every suit has different people. <laughs> That's interesting. It's amazing. Miracle Mask. <laughs> Only mostly dead. See, mostly dead is slightly alive. Now, if he was all dead, the only thing he could do is turn out his pockets for loose change. But mostly dead. I can work with it. I keep making the mistake of having my eye caught by items in the box, but it's really important. We're, we're playing hearts instead of marriage. That's blessed arrangement. All right. Same. I can do this all day. Here's your card. Here's my card. All right. What is that? That's just a. That's not even a, a thing. That's just. This is the art card. Art card. All right. Don't look at your card. All right. What are we even playing now? Indian Joe. Indian Joe. I think that's racist. It is. The camera's going to make it a little hard. Okay. So we can't look at the camera. All right. You're going to take the card and you're going to hold it to your forehead. Oh, this is where you guess if you're higher or lower? Yeah. All right. Uh, lower. Is that how it works? Did I win? Well, basically, you can choose to. Yeah, you won. <laughs> Game over. You can choose to stay in if you think you're going to be higher than me. Okay. Or you can bail. If I think I'm going to be lower than you, I yeah. can bail? Yeah. Yeah, I'm in. All right. So, all right. You're in ice if I'm in. I guess. Okay. Oh. All right. All right. Oh, 
I, I owe you a peanut. Also, I don't think we shuffled. I shuffled a little bit. A little bit. I right. shuffled the quarter of a deck because you were going through one by one. What's guy can't Tediously pulling out your cards. Does anybody want a peanut? Now I know. Yeah. You've got a whole thing here. Yeah. Oh my god. There's a bow tie. Is it a quidditch bow tie or what is it? There is a bow tie with dragons and 20 sided dice. Well, oh, it's a dungeon dragon. Yeah. You don't know that it's a dice. There's a die. Let's be fair. It's a die. What is this? Game of Thrones Stark Sigil USB flash drive? What? That's really sealed in there. It's not coming up. Alright. Winter is coming. That is actually really cool. That is, I wonder what the capacity is. It's probably only two gig or something, right? Yeah. It doesn't say. It's a mystery. Come on. That is intense. It's it's probably similar to the camera I was given at work that if you plug it in, but we put it on an FBI watch list. <laughs> There's files in here that should not be on any computer. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Oh, the pin. You got a little pin. It's not, like, this is just loot crates. Yeah. And it's got the X for where the treasure is. On yeah, there. what are you doing? You have to hold this up to that to make the treasure map work. Well, now, now you've given them both images. So you have to They've got the entire, together. They've got the entire map now. Loot crate knew you were going to unbox it. Little do I know that part of the secret part was burned onto the back of my palm. Yeah. I'll let you yeah. Jones, you so. got lucky. Yeah. I'm going to be step will be too high. Too I've, I've peeked into the treasure pile and I'm yes. not. I don't know. There's some weird items here. Yeah, this is. This is unidentified. Oh, God. <laughs> Let's get it going. I, I believe. It is getting going. Oh, my. <sighs> Played it. Let's go. You need to get your bow tie on. Yep. And now we can do this. You need to do this right. You can deck yourself out now. This is black tie geek, by the way. Black tie? I don't know how that is. Is it magnets? No, it's just a little clip. Oh, so you okay. just hold it on and clip into the front. Well, now I should have. I would have worn my formal t shirt. <laughs> Any t shirt's formal once you have a bow tie going. Yes, that's true. Which end has the clip? That end has the clip. Wow. Even fake bow ties are hard to tie. <laughs> I think it's a adjustable size too. Well, yeah, I probably should have adjusted the size. Look, look, it looks good there, right under my beard. Yeah, just like that's what the ties are for. Throttling you around the beard. All right. That crown, though, just yeah. absolutely absurd. So we got we got a it's a, it's oh. a platform nine and three quarter luggage tag. That way we can put on our luggage, let them know we're going to the secret mystery medical gate. And everyone who works there, what are we talking about? So just just put it. This is Three absurd. quarters of the way. Trust me, like I've done this before. Ooh, some magnets. I always we've got some uh, Game of Thrones magnets. I always forget the house words of uh, Lannister because it's hear me roar, but their catchphrase is the Lannister pays his debts. That's not their house words. That's just something Tywin came up with. They got too many, too many slogans. Oh, Which okay. house is? By men in. <laughs> what was that? The uh, Costanzas. Okay. What is this? What is this guy? Loot Crate Magazine. I forgot they were doing this. So there's a magazine. Because this is your first Loot Crate, right? This is my very first Loot Crate. When I did it, the boxes weren't themed. Okay. And there was no magazine. Oh, so just random stuff? No, no. I mean, the, there, was a, there was a general theme. The physical boxes printed. To match the theme, no. That's intense. That's new. Um, Is there? Did you give away more secrets? Were there more? No, it's just a little dungeon door down there. Okay. Full crate here to turn. So you can turn this inside out, and then this is the exterior of the box. And then I can store all your fancy stuff that you're never going to use. Right. In this box. This is like a mini. Mm -hmm. I'm being smacked a lot. All right. <laughs> this is time to kill you. I think that was pretty worth it. I would say I would easily have paid that much for the playing cards. I think, honestly, for me, the the big dollar item is this flash drive. Mm -hmm. 
because the shape on that is really rad. That is an intense flashcard. So now here's what my concern is. I don't, I don't have this problem on like PCs or laptops, uh -huh. but like just the, the PlayStation 4 has recently made me aware that weird shaped flash drives don't fit in it. And so now I'm concerned about weird shaped flash drives in general. You gotta buy one of those, um, the USB hubs. Yeah. Or, or an extender, which is what I have now, which is a one foot long extension cable. I remember those. Yeah. It's, it's exclusively so I can plug my Boba Fett flash drive into the PS4. The size of this box right here. So. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, you're just taking your sweet time fooling the ground back up. What? That's a. I think I would my actions. That's a cool box. This is, That's an this is the high dollar item. I know you're a big fan of boxes. I'm a package guy. That's what I was just I silently was inspecting the printing quality on this box <laughs> because I am a nerd. Would you like that? Oh, yeah, this is celebrating. Good. Seal it. And they can clone you from this in the future. Right. Just shoot it into space with uh, some hair and steam in it. What's his name? I don't know. I don't know what we're talking about. Uh, we're British. So we're in Branson? Oh. <laughs> From Ultima. Online? Yes. Or offline. Any kind of Ultima. All of the Ultimas. Richard, I'm pretty sure his name is Richard Perry. Then you're yeah. talking about Richard Branson. They're definitely going to revoke all of my geek cards if I got that wrong. Also, I don't know how to hold t-shirts. That's, the, that's what's my biggest problem with things that come shipped to you that they never fit back in the boxes. I always make them fit in the boxes. <laughs> that's never been a problem for me. Make it fit. Cut the shirt to hang shreds. So, I joined Loot Crate pretty much exclusively because they said it was going to be Princess Bride on this box. So, is it worth it? Yeah, this was worth it, but I signed up for three months and I'm scared. Next month hasn't been announced yet. Right. Could be anything. The beauty of something like this is if you have generally nerdy friends, you're going to know someone who wants their contents. That's true. So even if it's something you don't like, you've got someone you can give it to. And for 20 bucks. Right, that could be Christmas present for a year. The one thing I don't like, though, is in their ad reads, they say it's like having a friend who surprises you with a gift every month. It's like having a friend who goes, this is a thing you would like, 20, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> he holds things over and makes you pay for them. <laughs> Not quite a gift, but yeah, I mean, still quality. Yeah, it's not bad. And you've, you've determined the secret technique, which is that the box is really top. Yeah. You get two of these next month, we can come back and bay blade. Yeah. Bay blade flattle? I think it's called a flattle. Bay blade flattle. Yeah. Can you verify? Bay blade flattle? Beep, boop, beep. Yes, that's what it was. Rule rests heavily on my brow. Alright, Charlie, this is how you fold t shirts when you work in a retail situation. Alright. I'm going to teach y'all right now. Can you take the, see the shoulders here? Alright. Fold them back. And then it just comes up. And that's how you get the sweet store displays. Oh. Always with a logo. Just stuff that in that box there. <laughs> See? <laughs> Perfect. And then that's how you fold the t-shirt. Yeah. Surgery. Oh, here is it. Oh, it's funny what everything is. The t-shirt is just a loop to the coast. Oh, mm, mm -hmm. those sneaky wizards. The flame will crown. I'll well, figure that out. Yeah. Exclusive USB drives. Four days. Four days. That's not terrible. Four days.